Hello everybody, my name is Rolak, and welcome back to Amnesia. In the last episode, can't really recall what we did, because it's been like a week. I'm pretty sure we went into the morgue <clears throat> after exploring um, waterworks or whatever it is. Uh, lowered the water level, uh, injected ourselves with some kind of cure for a poison... So now we have all the means to explore down here. Yep, Daniel's not having a coughing fit, and we are all good. Well, except for our sanity, which is critically low, which I did not realize. A sewer. Fantastic. It's always the greatest to have in these types of games. Oh, hey, we got sand some sandy bag, I guess. If that's what that noise was. Yep, we're up to level three of uh, sanity. But hey, it's better than nothing. Okay. Well then, uh, I don't like the looks of this at all. So let's, let's have a let's have a gander. <clears throat> because what else is there? to do. I hope there's no water monster here. But there is that. Oh, yes, there is. Okay. <laughs> We're just going to wait here for a little bit. He's still here because the music is still going on. Alright, and we're good. I think, hopefully. Uh, what do we got here? What's happening? What are you doing? Let me go! Please, don't take me! Nobody ever returns! No. Ah! Bloody. What? <laughs> yeah. Figured as much. Alright, so. I'm guessing we're gonna have to jam this one way or another. Maybe throw a rock in there, if we can find a rock. I don't know. It certainly doesn't seem like there is anything to pick up here at all. water mostly he's not happy about that nothing over there what do we got down this way more different pathways fantastic anything here I mean, that sounded like the water monster, but I don't think he's actually in this area. I don't like these random noises either. They're never enjoyable. This ladder is broken, so... Uh, yeah, there's no chance of going up there anytime soon. This place isn't even that dark, so I don't even really need my lantern. That's good. My sanity is not really all going down all that much. And I have a feeling that way is locked. Either that or this is just another hub zone. I'm not sure. Is this locked? Oh, this is just a door. I thought it was like a... Ooh! Ah! I see. Well, let's fill this up. Eh, it's not too much. Okay. Um, <laughs> what the hell is this? I completely forgotten what the... Mementos, there we go. Two levers control the noisy machine. Okay. Well, if I can figure out what this does, this would be great. 
And as it currently stands, I have no idea what it does. So I guess we'll just have to uh, explore the other side just a little bit. That's not the right way. So I do seem to be a bit more, you know, just carefree about this whole horror experience. But that's because I've kind of figured it out now. Um, the monsters spawn whenever you hear the groaning. That's a clear indicator of where they are. Um, and the monsters only appear for as long as the music is suspenseful and, you know, dread dread-like. That's not the monster. Um, and once the music goes away, then you're just perfectly fine to do some exploring. Because there's, as far as I'm aware, there's been no other threat from the monsters after they leave. Because they have, like, a few phases. They have... What is this? Pipe seems to be loose. One pipe is loose and leaking water. Jesus. Alright. I've got a pipe now. When, uh... What good is that gonna do me? I guess we'll figure out one way or another. But yeah, no, I've, I've pretty much figured out the game at this point. Um, so, yeah, so as long as you don't hear the music going, then it should be fine. Because, like, there's no other threat here as far as I'm aware. Now then, I'm assuming that those levers control that water wheel. So, let's go ahead and take a look and see if they'll have any effect changing it. It certainly seems like it might have something to do with that. And the game just completely lagged there for no reason. Okay. So, um, what happens if we just put it at 2-1? Did that do anything? I feel like there's going to be a lot of back and forth. <laughs> as far as I'm aware, there's no notes that I've discovered to tell me what exactly to do. So, um, yeah, this might take a while. Well, that has changed completely. Oh, wait, no. Can I just jam it in here? Too fast to be jammed. Jamming the wheel. It must be for slow down. Is that not what I did? A small gear doesn't mean slow. What if it just means faster? Because smaller gears tend to move faster. What if it's big gear? Because big gears move a lot slower. I also don't know why there's two of them. So, so that's going to be a little bit of experimentation. No. Oh. No, oh, wait. Okay, that sounds like it's actually slowed down considerably. Oh yes, it has. I think I figured out the puzzle, guys. This probably isn't the best place to hide. Oh, he is right there. He is right there. <laughs> He's right there. want a little peek. Okay, he's not there. Okay, and yeah, we're good. Alright. So I figured it out. <laughs> I think it's also pretty clear that whenever a, a monster appears... You're, uh, you're doing the right thing. That's obviously a clear indicator. There we go. Let's slow down a lot more considerably. Will this work? Alright. I think we just crawl under? Yeah, there we go. Alright. 
progress. Looks like there's nothing here, so... I feel like if my luck means anything, that we're going to be encountering another goon soon. Possible to get through. One of the barred gates appears to be weaker than the rest. Can I just hammer it away? No. Looks like I'm going to have to get something a lot more heavier. A rock, maybe? No. Dead rats? Mm, definitely not. Ah. Well, this is lovely. Hey, man. What happened to you? Daniel, turn around this instant. You are carrying the shadow with you. Now, listen here. You know, I don't think you know the type of person. I cannot move this around at all. Wow. Well, uh, that's concerning. And that's also concerning. Um, I have a feeling we're going to encounter something very bad here. Well, that's a rock that I cannot pick up. Um, so, what do I do? What's up? Bar gate was torn down without my creature. Cool. I'm just gonna wait somewhere. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Uh oh. Uh oh. Ho. Oh. Eh. Okay, we are. Good. I'm sorry if I'm not being interactive with the monsters enough, but I just really don't want to encounter them. I know that's kind of the whole point of the game, is to get chased by monsters and shit, but I just really don't want to go through that. I have a weak heart, and I can't handle that. Well, you might get your wish. Because uh, this seems like a very large and open area. With no chance of uh, finding a way out. Oh, he's just standing there. Ugh, okay. Um, maybe I can lure him around with something? I don't really have... There's nothing... I've yet to find something I can actually throw around in this area. Oh, there we are. Eh. Maybe that did the trick. Okay, it did. I'm just gonna go. I'm just gonna go. And we're all good. No, we're not! We are very not! Oh, God! <laughs> ah! Ah! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you don't have to tell me twice! <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> oh, I probably should have closed the doors behind me. <laughs> oh, we're gonna have to do all that over again. God damn it. <laughs> All right. Is he still there? No, we're just gonna have to go straight into the running phase. Fantastic. Well, let's just start running right now.
Or he's not going to appear at all. Well, that's kind of lame. I would have expected something, you know, more aggressive. It's a long stair. It's a long ladder. There we go. All right. Well, that was fun, <laughs> but not really. <laughs> I was really expecting him to come back again. All right, where the hell are we now? Ooh, hey, tinderbox. Because while that was a fun little spot, I really have no idea where we are or what we're doing. So what's my sanity? Crystal clear. Right, I died, so it would make sense to be back at fault. So I guess we're good for that. Hello? Hello. Hello. Okay, well, this all seems to be the same. Uh, and that's not good. Okay, that one's locked. So we got two options. And both of them are probably not as great as you would think. How many are we at? We're at 30. That's really good. Ah, more oil. It's not a lot, though. What do we got? 9th of August, 1839. I can't stop sweating and shaking. The warding ritual was not something of a sane mind. I did not even realize the dungeon was still in use. Alexander had his servants bring one of the prisoners, a murderer, he told me. Alexander made all the arrangements, but he said I had to perform the ritual in order to have the right effect. The shadow could be led astray by the blood of another. Killing the man would provide us precious time. What else could I do? Alexander said it had to be done. He is saving my life. I don't have the luxury of argument. Okay. So what do we do here then? No oil left in barrel. Alright, well, since nothing's popped out yet, nothing's yelling at me, uh, let's do a little bit of exploration. Why not? Seems like a relatively safe place to use some tinderboxes as well, so why not? Hello? Hello? How many are we at? 28. Wow. Okay, well, I have a feeling... We're going to have to come back here eventually, so let's see what awaits us. Should we just run? It seems like a long staircase, and I feel like I should have done something with those levers. Okay, those are just ambient chains, not person chains. A lot of tinder boxes here. So yeah, this is all completely unknown territory. I have no idea what's to be expected from this game now. Like the sewers, up until I think uh, it was the prison. The prison was the last part where me and my friends start playing. Or er, stop playing. Agrippa, I need you to stay awake. Can you feel the syringe? No, I can't feel anything. Alexander? Yes. Soon, I won't even be able to move, will I? Your life is safe. I don't doubt that. But will it be worth living? That's concerning. I also need to be just a moment. Sorry. Alright, we're all good. Uh... Ah, pitch darkness. Great. Right, what is laboratory? Well, that's evident as always. Eh, why not? We'll light a few more. What's the worst that can happen? Shovel? This place is fairly well lit. I think. 
What is this? Who is... Um, hi? shall fall, you say. <laughs> You've hurried too much. Alexander is toothless without an all. Yes. That's... That's not very promising at all. The sanctum is basically a penetrant. But I guess why not? It could be breached by another. But Alexander broke his... I mean, my all. A long time ago. Really? Well, if you tell the truth, by all means, seek out the pieces of the broken orb and mend away. I believe he uses them for torture now. They practically leak matter, which is quite useful, I understand. There should be six of them. Look around the choir and the transept. You should be able to find them there. Orb is needed to enter the inner sanctum. Its shattered pieces lie scattered in the torture rooms. All right, thanks, stranger, who I think is Agrippa. Dad, I hate to bother you further, but if you're really going after Alexander, would you consider taking me with you? I know it sounds ridiculous. I mean, look at me. But if you find anything concerning a man named Johann Heim, would you please bring it to me? I believe he was working on a way to help him. A recipe for some sort of potion. A tonic to free me from this husk of mine. Agrippa, yep, that's him. The dying man seeks a note written by a man named Johann Ware. I'm keep an eye out. I'm Heinrich Cornelius Agrippa. I was once quite important to you. Baron Alexander has sustained my soul in this dead husk for years. Who knows how many? Hundreds, I presume. All right. Alexander is quite impressive in many ways, but he has grown impatient. All right. Good to know. So, I feel like this is a good stopping point. By me? I'm the next best thing. Alexander really found none of us is Johann Bayer. You never heard of Johann Bayer? My god boy, he's probably the greatest man in history. And you don't know him? Or is it the world who has forgotten him? I really don't know, man. I feel like he's going to be talking a lot, so I'm just going to end the episode while we still have a chance. So, next time on Amnesia, we're going to be mucking about, yes, exploring this area, seeing what it has to offer, and seeing if we can help out uh, Mr. Agrippa over there. So, yeah. See you guys next time. What now? Yeah. You don't really have to write that down, Daniel. <laughs>